Welcome back folks to a brand new video. Malaysia has to be one of the most diverse countries in Asia. From musty cities to religious cultural sites to some of the best islands and beaches. There are hundreds of places to see, but I've selected just a few. So here are 12 useful places to visit in Malaysia. Let's do it. Now before you even watch this video, don't forget to hit that like button, obviously for the YouTube algorithm. Number one. Human Island. Human Island lies on the east coast of the peninsula of Malaysia, south of China Sea. It's a perfect getaway for anyone interested in East Coast travel due to its natural beauty and abundant wildlife. They say in the 70s, Time magazine declared it one of the most beautiful islands in the world. The fact that even the islands are still king on to 50 years later. Number 
There are many reasons why you should visit Malaysia. And Redang Island is definitely one of them. Pulau Redang is one of those perfect postcard islands with bright white sand and crystal blue waters. Located off the east coast of Malaysia and part of the coral triangle between Papua New Guinea, the Philippines, and Indonesia, it's a global center for marine biodiversity. The interior of the island is packed with jungle, and there are a bunch of hiking routes to choose from. Most aren't that difficult, and will only take you a few hours. This destination is perfect for those wanting to dive and for diving. Number 6. Ipo. Ipo is a city in northwestern Malaysia, known as the gateway to the Cameron Highlands Hill Station. Ipo is a captivating city that uses history and a You can walk the Ipo Heritage Trail, which is a mapped route that takes in 27 of the city's most important landmarks, including the British Colonial Railway Station, which you can peel back the layers of Ipo's history. Now, some of the best things to do in this city revolve around eating and, of course, drinking. And apparently, Malaysia's Michael which is an ice cream made with coffee beans soaked in margarine is quite popular. Langkawi is home to three protected geoforest parks and many coconut tree lined beaches. Some beaches are very popular for tourists, while others on the small northeastern islands have a backdrop of limestone cliffs and are more secluded. Now, the biggest attractions are the Skycap and Sky Bridge. The world's steepest cable car, which takes you from the Oriental Village complex to a bridge suspended 100 meters in the air for amazing views across the island. Other activities in Langkawi are boating, where you are able to see mangroves of the protected geoforest parks, or see bats roosting in the caves or eagles soaring above the different peaks. There are tons of things to do. Number 8. Malacca. Malacca is a historic port city set on Malaysia's southwestern coast. It's a place that oozes with history and of course
to Kinabali or Kote as it's commonly known, is considered the gateway city for anyone looking to enjoy the beauty of Borneo. However, it's fast emerging as a popular tourist destination in its own right. To experience the true beauty of the Kinabali, you must visit the Kinabali. The interior of the island is packed with jungle, and there are a bunch of hiking routes to choose from. Most aren't that difficult, and will only take you 